Breaking news right now on Detroit's east side where police are raiding a gas station. 7 Action News reporter Aaron Baskerville is live now at the scene. Aaron, what's happening? We're at John R. Road, an eight mile, like you said, on the city's east side. And police, along with the chief, just walked inside the Sunoco gas station and basically just shut it down. They said they're done. The chief saying he's getting rid of all bad neighbors. Those are his words. Take a look behind me. If you can see that yellow piece of paper taped to the door, it's basically telling this business they're done, they're shut down. We shot a little bit of video just about 20 minutes ago or so, and it's us walking in along with several officers and the chief, him walking up to the owner, who of course is very upset, telling him he's done. This is all over drug paraphernalia. Apparently, the owner and others inside here have been selling brown little bags inside, have drug pipes. Other pipes, gra uh, glass pipes that are used to sell and smoke crack. So, of course, the chief is very upset about that. He continued to talk to the owner. He admitted to actually selling this stuff, uh, these pipes, but he said everybody else in the area does it, so why shouldn't he? We had a chance to catch up with that owner, and here's our confrontation with him just a little while ago. You know what they use that pipe for? How do I know? I'm not a deuce. I know, but you're an intelligent, you're an intelligent man. You're an intelligent man. You know why they use that. You have a lot of crackheads around here. Exactly, okay, so exactly. They if they use it, what do I do with it? Why the police don't catch the people who sell drugs around because here? They so the chief tells me this is just the beginning. They're doing surveillance on several gas stations across the area. There's messages, we're coming after you, basically, so you better be a good neighbor or you're next. He says there's other gas stations in the area. You heard the owner say, there's several in the area. Why are you just coming after me? But this is not the end for this gas station owner. He has a hearing scheduled next Tuesday to see if he can get his shop back open. But for now, he's closed down for the weekend. The chief sending a strong message today. It's going after anybody who's selling drug paraphernalia, crack pipes, anything like that. They're done. Let's send it back to you in the studio. Aaron, quick question for you. Did that uh, gas station owner get a warning from the chief or the police department, or did no. they just... They did it within 24 hours. He mm. was yelling about, why don't I get a warning, or why didn't you tell me or anything about this? But the chief said they did this very quickly, 24 hours. They've had some surveillance on this. They recovered, I think, 23 different brown little bags filled with those pipes. He said other, more than 100 other items that have to do with drug paraphernalia. So he says this gas station, it's a bad neighbor. And no, there was no warning. 24-hour notice to get this done. They came and they shut it down. Yeah, Chief, not playing around. That's evident right there. All. Thanks a lot, Aaron. And